One of the reasons why St. Joseph is the greatest saint is because of the role that he played in the history of salvation. Some basic theology. These are the words we should try to understand today in our little class, little lesson. Latria. Then we have hyperdulia. We have dulia. And then we have the word protodulia. What do those words mean? Latria is our relationship with God. And it means, the word latria means uh, adoration. We're called to adore and praise and worship God alone. For this we, reason we say, glory be to the Father, to the Son, the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Then there's the word hyperdulia. And dulia is a word that comes from Greek, and it actually means veneration. Hyperdulia. We give the, the highest, the greatest veneration we give to Mary, the mother of God. Mary is the daughter of God the Father. She's the mother of God the Son. She's the mystical spouse of the Holy Spirit. Then to the saints, we have the word dulia. We give veneration to the saints. So we don't adore the saints. But rather, we pay them homage. We venerate the saints. But there's another class. And it's protodulia. Protodulia means this. First in veneration, we give this to St. Joseph. Of all the saints, St. Joseph comes first. Because of, of the lofty, and I say the lofty mission that God has given to St. Joseph to be both the spouse of Mary, the mother of God, as well as he is the father, the earthly father of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ, as you see in this, in this painting. So draw closer to St. Joseph. We'll be celebrating his feast day on March 19th. Consecrate yourself, give yourself to Jesus, through Mary, and through St. Joseph. Amen.